month ago, she survived a fatal motorcycle accident at 78th and Dodge. Doctors weren't sure she'd make it, but now Rachel McKetto is taking the next step toward recovery, and she is speaking exclusively with our Jessica Gill tonight. Yeah, we had to work on anxiety this morning, didn't we? Yes, we did. Madonna Rehabilitation Hospital in Lincoln is Rachel McKetto's new home, and it'll be that way for a while. I'm trying as hard as I can just to become positive, to be optimistic. But it hasn't been easy for Rachel. She's in a lot of pain. Just two weeks ago, a motorcycle accident at 78th and Dodge claimed the life of her boyfriend and left her in critical condition. Among a number of injuries, she broke her pelvis in several places and now has screws in her waist, giving her midsection stability. She admits she becomes easily frustrated by her lack of mobility. And I become very, very insecure and very, um, very tired too at times. Just even lifting my hand or my leg up will put me out of breath, which I'm not used to at all. But to have a second chance at life, every arm lift, every push up. Uh, down, down, doing okay? Yeah. Okay, good. Even sitting up for an extended period of time, it's all worth it, according to Rachel. According to her parents, it's a miracle. It makes me tear up and cry. I mean, literally, because she's a miracle. I mean, she literally is our miracle warrior. We didn't think she would live through this. And to see this incredible progress that she's made in less than two weeks, it truly is a gift. Rachel has about six months of rehab ahead of her. She'll likely be out of work for about a year. As you can imagine, the medical bills are beginning to pile up, but she does have a GoFundMe page set up with a $30,000 goal. If you'd like to help her out on her journey toward recovery, we've got all the information under this story on our website. That's WOWT.com. With senior photographer Nick Bohan, I'm Jessica Gill, WOWT 6 News.